Hi Fishers residents, today I am out here at our agri park and today we are talking about some corn. So out here at the agri park we have two different types of corn. We have our sweet corn and we have our field corn. So what I'm seeding in right now is our field corn. So when you're driving down the road in the country here in Fishers, you are most likely seeing field corn rather than sweet corn. Now I'm standing in our sweet corn. So as you can see, these stalks are not nearly as tall as our field corn stalks. So our sweet corn is only going to get a little bit taller than I am right now. I'm 5'3", so these are about the height that they'll be a little bit more throughout the season. Sweet corn stalks are only going to grow one or two ears for an entire season. This ear is almost ready. We're still missing a few matured kernels here. So this is what we can eat every day. This is our field corn then. So as you can see, they are a little bit different in their appearances. So this one is field corn, this one is sweet corn. So your field corn is going to have 16 rows average um, with about 800 kernels on it. Your rows on here are always going to be an even number. So field corn is really good for our environment because it absorbs carbon dioxide and gives off oxygen just like a rainforest would. There's also about 3,500 different uses for field corn as well. Livestock, poultry, and dairy farmers are the biggest users of field corn. So they use about 6 million bushels every year to help feed their livestock and their animals. Some of the byproducts we get from the field corn are things like tortilla chips, cornmeal, um, and anything really that you're seeing like corn syrup in your cabinets. Next time you're out at our agri park, be sure to check out our sweet corn area and our field corn area and see if you can spot the differences that we have out here on the two different types of corn.